Hi, I'm Russ Baker, investigative journalist and author of Family of Secrets. My book is a new exploration of George W. Bush, his family, and their impact on America and the world. Now, Bush has his own book out, and he's made some comments about it, to which I'd like to respond. When I sat down to write my memoirs, I decided to take an untraditional approach. Rather than provide an exhaustive chronological account of my life and years in office, I wanted to give readers a glimpse of the presidency from my perspective. Is he really shattering the conventions of political autobiography? They say he's been strikingly candid about his journey, but I've spent five years investigating what he really did, who he really is, and the real story of how he became president. You won't find any of it in his book, but you'll find all of it in mine. The book opens with a personal decision, quitting drinking at age 40, a decision I could not have made without faith. The story of how George Bush got religion and became born again was fabricated, including a phony walk on the beach with the Reverend Billy Graham. Family of Secrets takes you inside the kitchen of the evangelical political advisor whose so-called red memo convinced Bush that by presenting himself as a fundamentalist, he could take the presidency. I write a little bit about the experiences that forged my character. Growing up in West Texas, being the son of a president, meeting my wife, Laura, and raising our twin daughters. I describe the path that led me into politics and ultimately to make one of the toughest decisions of my life, running for president of the United States. The real story of what he was doing involves drugs, abortion, and other activities that Bush himself would later condemn as a politician. This would have destroyed his family politically were it not for a cover-up orchestrated by his father that has lasted for decades. It's all detailed and footnoted in Family of Secrets. Then I describe the horror and heroism of September the 11th, 2001, when America suffered the most devastating surprise attack since Pearl Harbor. 9-11 changed the course of history and led to the hardest decision any president can make, deploying American troops into combat. George W. Bush's former writing partner told me that Bush was already talking about his desire to invade Iraq two years before 9-11 and before he was even the Republican nominee for the presidency. I write about the response to Katrina. Of course, Bush couldn't have foreseen the disaster in New Orleans. But he did have an incompetent show horse investigator running America's disaster response team. In Family of Secrets, I show how Michael Brown's appointment at FEMA was part of a broader agenda to destroy government agencies and outsource their functions to financial backers and private industry. I'm traveling the country talking about our hidden history and how we are manipulated into acting against our own interests by the most ruthless disinformation machine the world has known. That's the real story of Bush and the story found in Family of Secrets. They're printing 1.5 million copies of Bush's book. Maybe you're going to read it, that's fine, but please read mine too help inject some real facts into the American conversation. Thank you.